What we discussed up till now was basically what is covered in HTTP 1.1, which was the latest version of HTTP till 2015. And it's still, with 60% of websites using it, the most widely used version. The main upgrade of HTTP 1.1 to HTTP 1, in addition of a few methods like put and delete we discussed, in terms of reducing delay, was using persistent instead of non-persistent connections. So HTTP 1.1 enabled persistent HTTP and allowed multiple pipeline gets over a single TCP connection to decrease delay. However, a problem called head of line blocking that could happen in transmission of large objects could slow the process down. HTTP 2, which is a new version introduced in 2015 and gaining popularity fast, solves this problem with changing first-come, first-served response order and dividing objects to frames and scheduling the frames instead. Let's examine head-of-line blocking through an example. Assume the client has requested four objects, 01, 02, 03, and 04. 01 is a large object. And if we send objects in first come first serve order, as HTTP 1.1 does, all of 02, 03, and 04 will be delayed significantly while waiting for 01 transmission. HTTP 2 solves this problem by dividing objects into frames and interleaving transmission of those frames. This causes 02, 03, and 04, which are smaller objects, and therefore will have a smaller number of frames to be delivered quickly. 01, with larger number of frames, will only slightly be delayed due to those frames interleaving in the beginning.